Hey there! Welcome to Mentoring Moments! And now our topic for today is finding your loved one. Are you looking for love in the wrong places? So through 3Ms, we're gonna find out who really is the special one for you. First, M. You need to know who your master is. It's important for you to understand first your identity, who you are, and who you belong to. Because to begin with, we don't live our life for ourselves. We need to understand that there is a higher authority over us. And you belong to God. Since God is the creator of the universe and God has created you, He has a special purpose for each and every one of us. And we have to go back to our master to know what His will is for our life. So when you obey Him, you'll find out your special one. So you need to know who your master is and you need to follow your master and then your master will give you your mission in life. And what do you get when you have your mission in life? When you get your mission, it will become your purpose. Your mm -hmm. purpose, what you're doing, what you need to do, what you're passionate about, what drives you. And when, you're, uh, when you are following your mission, you will be at the center of God's will. And how can you go wrong with that? When you're, you're at the center of God's will, you'll find a satisfying, fulfilling life. Exactly. Which leads us to what really tan -tan -tan -tan, it's all about. It's finding your mate. Your mate. Along with knowing your master, which leads you to your mission, now you will get to know who your mate is. When you are in the middle of God's will and you are pursuing your mission in life, then it would be ideal for you to discover your perfect and ideal mate. Because when you're on the road to your mission, that is the most satisfying and fulfilling journey to actually find the right person. You won't only discover a future wife or a lover, but you'll actually discover someone who can be a lifetime partner. Yeah. So it's not just about finding who the right person is. It's not just finding your mate, but you first have to focus on your first M, which is our master. Focus on God and then know your mission. For by knowing God, you will know your purpose, knowing your mission, and then eventually along the way, you will find your mate. Take it from me, I found my perfect mate, and I'm married to that one. Have you found your mate? I will! <laughs> <laughs> so thank you for catching up with us at Mentoring Moments, the three M's in finding your special one.